started off with the back three, what, the role of the wingers and how like, the position you want to see them in? Yeah, obviously, um, kicking game is the most important part of the game now, you know, because yeah. we're all very much gridlined up. Yeah. We're all about field position and, uh, and inches and metres. But, uh, you know, I think before we can sort of talk about the back three, it's, it's, it's how you, the pressure you put on the kicker will determine the quality of the kick and, and how aggressively you can come in on the ball. So uh, it's a bit of a chain reaction. If, if your pressure on the kick is poor, you're going to find uh, that ha what happens is is the kick is going to hit open space, you're going to get more chases, and they, they can really compress their defence up and, and be aggressive on you. And obviously uh, the idea is when you put pressure on a kicker is to make him kick up, you get greater hang time. Uh, with hang time you can catch the ball in the full. Obviously no pressure, he gets time to uh, get along the ground. So th that, that has a big bearing on, on your back three uh, because of uh, how they can come in on the ball. Um, every coach is probably different, you know, everyone's got different philosophies. Sometimes uh, some coaches want to be conservative from the back, you know, they want to they want to be the ball back and they get in a routine of, you know, the wingers helping out, uh, dummy half runs and things like that. So I think I think it's, it comes back to a little bit personally on uh, myself. We, we, I'd rather be very aggressive in that area. Mm. I think it's an area that creates momentum. I think uh, the momentum you create there will uh, set the standard for your first few rucks. So. Um, it's pretty similar to what, what we talk about in normal attack. It's, it's your shape off the ball. Obviously, if a fullback's bringing the ball back and a winger's behind him, he's not a threat and he's not an option. So, um, you know, it's, it's important that you can get a pass. It's important that you can get across the, the defence. And it's important that you put some doubt in the defence. And I think uh, that is looked at unfavourably by some fans because they see a risk element in there. But uh, I'll probably a little bit on the philosophy is if you had a two-on-one going into a trial line, you'd expect to pass it. And if you've got a two-on-one coming off your trial line, you should also be expected to pass it. And um, I think if you don't think about the consequences, you're of uh, a greater, greater chance of being more adventurous. <laughs>